Hi guys, and welcome back to episode 5 of The Sims 3 Generations Let's Play. So I know I haven't filmed this in, I think it was about 3 weeks, which is a long time for me not to record this LP. Um, the reason being is I wanted to finish Pets first so that I wouldn't have too many LPs going on at the same time. And since that is now finished, uh, my main focus will be on my Generations LP. So that explains that. Um, in this episode, I'm hoping I'll be able to go ahead and throw Lance and, oh my gosh, I forgot her name. Oh, Destiny's. Got her name. <laughs> Lance and Destiny's Bachelor and Bachelor Party. Um, I don't know how that's going to work out considering they don't have any friends here. Like, nobody. Like, her friends are the babies <laughs> and his friends is her and his boss. So, what I am doing right now is I had Lance go to the library and we're going to go ahead and have him chat with some people online. So let's go ahead and follow him. Um, Destiny is still working. Her shift doesn't end until I believe 6 o'clock, oh 7 p.m. I always say 6, I don't know why. But until 7, um, she has a day off tomorrow. But let's go ahead and visit Lance at the library and have him chit chat with a few people. Um, only if I knew where Lance... Oh, there he is. Okay, so let's go ahead and... I'm pretty sure there was computers here. Or not. Oh, yeah, there are. Okay, let's go. Go to this computer. And let's... Not you. Not you. Lance. We're gonna have Lance go ahead and... Ch -ch 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 chat with some people. We're gonna have him do this with a bunch of people, so... Oh, wait, you can choose who to chat with. Chat with. Oh, he's only one person. <laughs> the only person is his boss. That's so sad. <laughs> oh my god. This world is populated though, which I'm confused about. <laughs> Let's go ahead and have him introduce himself to Angelica Wyatt. Um, oh, I want to do friendly introduction. No, not rude. <laughs> Friendly introduction. I don't know if you'll be able to talk to other people, considering that it only said one person's online. Uh, hmm. Let me go back to Destiny quickly, because I need to make sure that the kids are being taken care of and everything. So, let's see. So, sh There's really not much. Let me see. Room for a snack. She's in a great mood, but a little hungry. So yeah, she's just going to go ahead and feed them. And then... I mean, I don't know if he can talk to other people, or... What? I'm not sure. I hope so. Because usually when he starts talking to a person, it'll like pop up in here, right? I think so. Ugh, I don't know. I mean, it is kind of hard, um, you know, trying to get to know people when they're never, they've never they never left their house, really. Uh, plus, we just started this Let's Play, so it's kind of like, ugh, you know. A bit hard, but let's at least go ahead and make a few friends. If he makes friends with her, then we'll be able to get a destiny to make friends with her. So she'll at least have one person to go out to a party with, I guess, rather than just going by herself, you know? I don't know. Is it going to work? Lance, are you going to go ahead and talk to Angelica? <laughs> Oh no, she's sick. Okay, well, that's gonna take a while. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, this baby didn't show up this time. We got a different baby. We got, who is this? Who is this baby? Oh, we got Tara McRae. And Christy Calderon is the one that didn't come this time. Okay, Lance. Talk to her.
<laughs> well, I guess that's a nice way to introduce yourself to somebody. Wipe your nose. Yeah, so, um, nice to meet you. Stop scratching your nose, boy. Look at him. <laughs> She's, like, crying. She's, like, why? Why can't you just be nice to me? <laughs> oh, God. I don't know why that, that cracks me up. Anyway, let's go ahead and... I don't know. There's people here. Yes! Yes, people! Oh my god. Oh my god. I've never been so happy to see people. No. No. He is just newly engaged. We are not gonna be like, hey, um, wanna be with me? Because, you know, I'm engaged and all. It doesn't matter. No. Jesus. Okay, we're gonna introduce to everybody here. You know. Because we want to be friendly with people. Uh, and this kid. He has the same hairstyle as you. Let's see if he's any cute. If, if he's any cute. If he's a cute. Zip-zip. Zip-zip. <gasps> Who is he attracted to? No. No. This can't be. No. I don't know. Who is the attractive company? Oh my god, Lance. <gasps> what the? Uh, guys? Th she did not look like that. That's her. What? What happened? What in the world? How did she change? She was just... Or is it a different person? Am I going crazy? I swear. No, it is her. Did she like just form into this? Am I going crazy? I, I don't know. I have no idea. I'm so confused right now. You know, instead of throwing the bachelorette parties today, I think I'll have... Um, I'll have them get to know people first and then do that because if without knowing people it's going to be hard to throw any parties. So what I'll probably do is off camera try and get um try and get them to have like closer relationships with people so that we can throw a decent bachelorette and bachelor party. I don't know what's going on with her. Like sh does she look like this before? Like look at her hair. Honey, this is what's called bedhead. Yes, honey. Daycare, end of the day report. Star Cauldron, good. Tara McRae, good. So that's awesome. Looks like the parent of Star Cauldron will be late. Destiny Baker will need to take care of this child until the parent shows up. Yeah, see? She looks different here. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> well then, let's go and see Destiny. Um, so they said that there's one more kid left. Um, hopefully their parents show up soon. But the thing, rep the report popped up for two kids, so I'm confused. Oh, Destiny's so pretty. I say that every episode, but you know it's true. It's true. Um, what the heck? Your parents didn't come pick you up yet. What is this? Oh wait. Here's somebody. Is she a teen? She's probably a teen, so it'd be kind of awkward if you invited a teen to, um, you know, uh, what's it called? A bachelorette party, so you probably shouldn't. Okay. Do these sims even have homes? Like, I feel like they just come out of nowhere. Is that what it is? Like... Do they live anywhere? Or do they just like, oh, I'm here. Well, no, this person has a house, so... No, they can't, they can't be. I don't know. Let's go check back up on... <sighs> Lance. Such a confusing situation, I have no idea. What is happening, guys? See, look... <laughs> 
what happened? What the heck happened? Oh my gosh. Well, he introduced himself to her. So go introduce yourself now to these lovely people. Um, why is everybody all of a sudden getting fat? Like, that... He didn't look like that before. When he was standing there. Did he? I honestly don't know. Is it like a... Uh, like, I have no problem with... With it, but like, it's just weird that everybody's just like turning up and like, they were thin, but now they're becoming fat. Like, did they go through like, uh like a warp thing where you walk in and you become fatter or something like that. I'm so, so confused. Oh my god. Like, like this is the only part of her hair. I don't think she straightened her hair correctly because look, there's only one section of her hair that's actually straight. I think you need a better hair straightener or at least a better mirror. <laughs> Um, yeah, so, I don't, <laughs> I don't know what to say. Oh, let me go back to Destiny. And let's see if she can go ahead and go somewhere to meet people, because, you know, uh, she needs to meet some. Oh, and she's starting to get really hungry and tired. Is this a teen? Or is this a normal it's person? I think she's a normal human. Hold on. Yeah. Obviously. Um, let me go, let's go introduce ourselves to her. Oh, can you not? That's so stupid. Why? He okay, will then... Like, you see what I mean? Like, random people come to pick up the kids. Like, who... You probably don't have the last name. Yeah, Pruitt and... What's her face? Tanika Thompson. I don't know. I have no idea. But, like, that doesn't make sense to me. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and have her... First off, clean out the bad food because, you know, we don't want to spoil all of our food. Um, we're going to clean that up, but we're also going to go ahead and serve dinner. Because when Lance comes home from talking to some strange people, we will, well, he's going to want to come home to food, right? I mean, she's going to be a very, very good mother, I believe. She will be. And a wife. So... You know. Oh, people are starting to get tired. Okay, go introduce yourself to, uh, what's his face? Kirby, Ro Kirby Rosa. And then you're going to go ahead and introduce yourself to a few more, a few other people. But what I think I will do is I think I'm going to go ahead and skip until the morning time because... There's, I don't want, there's not much going to be happening. I'm just going to have the meeting and getting ready for bed and stuff like that. So, yeah, I'll see you guys then. Alright guys, so I thought I was recording and then I forgot to press record. So, basically, let me explain what happened. So, I sent Lance and Destiny over to the Summer Festival because today is Leisure Day. So, I thought that it would be great for them to go out and meet people. And so, uh, Destiny met this woman... Um, Audra Holt, and she has a baby, Taurus Holt, and a husband, Boyd, and another daughter, Michael. Um, okay, um, I don't know, I guess that's, they just wanted that. Um, and then they have a son, Shelby Holt. So, what my idea is that I feel like we should get these guys to, like, start hanging out and, like, Kind of have, like, when they start, when Lance and Destiny start their family, they'll have, like, um, Audra and Boyd, like, telling them how to, like, take care of children. Even though Destiny is kind of, like, already a nurturing, um, she has a nurturing trait, so she'll already have, like, that kind of um, motherly instinct already. But I think that would be so cool if they had, like, like family friends, like, like really close. And, that, like, their kids would hang out with each other. And I just, I don't know, I think that would be really cool, so... That is my idea for right now. Um, I am having them ask each other to um, go apple bobbing and pie eating contests because I think that would be really cool to have them just go ahead and, you know, interact. But, like, I feel like the, they would be such good friends. I don't know why. I hope they will. But as well as um, 
Boyd and Lance. I think that'd be cool. But there's so many people that are dressed exactly the same. Like, look at there's like one, two, three girls the same and three guys. Uh, I'm confused. I'm so confused. Like, why is there a kissing booth attendant? Like, where's the kissing booth? Like, I don't see anything. Is it like glitched or something? Because then there's like food merchants, maybe? Like, I need to re reinstall something, because something, like, look, there's nothing here. I'm really confused. But I know there's an apple bobbing station, because I saw it over here somewhere. Where is it? Yeah, it's right there. So that's the only thing, but I don't know, is it going to work? Yeah. <laughs> or do they not have one? Oh, what's going CJ. on? Oh, God, these <laughs> sims. Oh, my God. I'm assuming there isn't one. Hmm. This is really strange. Where is he? Oh. I don't know what I should do. I might have to move this family into another um, world because if we're not going to have, like, places to go, it's going to be really strange because I want to have them interact in, like, the summer festival and, like, all the other festivals and, like, other places. But, I mean, if it's going to be like this, I don't think um, Storybrooke County is going to work unless I need to take this family out and then put them back in. But as of right now... If I don't figure out the problem, then, yeah, the my last resort is going to be to either move them in and out of this world or completely different world. I'm not sure what world I would choose yet, but I might, if anything, I ha might have you guys vote for what world to play them in. But, yeah, let's just go ahead. Since you can't do that, just interact with them and, like, get to know them better here. Be friendly to her. Friendly, um, chat. Oh yeah, we can cool over children. It's friendly, cool over children. And let's have him chat with... Hmm, that's really weird. I don't know why this world is glitching for me. I really wish it didn't. Uh, let's go ahead and have him be funny, tell a funny story, kind of get along with him. And you hear screaming, and it's not the fall festival either, so I'm kind of confused about what's going on. Uh, he just trip over nothing. Um, let's go ahead and get to know him. Like, what the heck? <laughs> oh my god. I don't even know. There might be a festival lot that I have to install. I don't know, hopefully I find out the problem. But I think since there's not much I can do right now, I think what I'm going to go ahead and do is end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Not much really happened since I just came back to this Let's Play. So hopefully we can go ahead and get back into the swing of things. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and give this video a thumbs up. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.